Here we have to wait one hour before we take the train to Dandong, which is a town that borders North Korea. There we have to transfer to another train, which brings us to Pyongyang. to walk to the bridge which we will cross to North Korea. It's on the other side. It is one of the few ways to enter or leave North Korea and pedestrians are not allowed to cross on either side. On the right side you see the remainings of the broken bridge. This bridge was bombed by the Americans during the Korean War and serves now as a monument to peek into North Korea. And now you can also see the broken bridge I was talking about. It's weird to see the tourists having a look into North Korea while we were actually going there. Where we had our first introduction with the North Korean authorities. They checked our passports and visas. It was less tense as I expected and the Koreans from customs were quite friendly. In the first train from Beijing to Dangdong, I really had a good sleep. I did that on purpose because I thought I, I don't want to sleep or feel sleepy in a train in, in North Korea because I want to see everything outside. It's super shiny, so everything is really clear. I really wanted to try my first North Korean food in the train, but I guess it was not my luck this time. Still, it was interesting to walk around and to see many Koreans drinking and eating on the ground between the beds. Inside, the popcorn was already waiting for us. And we were about to see a British, Belgian, North Korean romantic comedy. Comrade Kim goes fly. In the movie, it's about uh, the circus, you know? Mm. So one of the uh, circus actors, he was actually in the cinema. Mm. So we had like five minutes of time to take a picture together with him. Fan service is really good. Have you seen a movie? What did you see? Uh, it was a comrade Kim goes flying. Mm. It was a really funny uh, movie, but it feels like it's so like propaganda. Ah. Like show how beautiful everything is. And mm. after the movie, even I felt good. 극장 보니까 팝콘 먹는 거는 뭐전 세계 어디서나 다 똑같 북한도 똑같네요. 저는 영화관에서 팝콘을 먹어본 적은 없는데 지금은 외국인을 위한 특별한 서비스가 아닌가 생각이 됩니다. 